Tapirs are some of the best animals on Earth because they're the kind of animal that if you've never seen one, you assume that people are just making it up if they describe it to you. Drowsy then combines that with the myth of the Baku, a dream-eating chimeric creature from Japanese mythology that itself might in fact have been inspired by tapirs, at least in part, originally. Like a lot of Gen 1 Pokemon, the complexity of Drowsy's design is limited by the low amount of detail you can render in a 56 by 56 sprite, and so its design is maybe a little bit too simple for the concept. All the detail is concentrated in the face, leaving the body just some round shapes with a color boundary on it. I really wish there was a little bit more to it. And it's the same story with Hypno, which seems to take after a proboscis monkey, maybe? All the detail goes to the face and the collar and the little pendulum, leaving the rest of it just a generic, entirely humanoid-shaped body. For how high concept it is, based on a chimeric folklore creature, the design is ultimately a little bit undercooked, I think. Subscribe to this channel for more reactions and hot takes, or head on over to my main channel for longer in-depth videos.